All right, guys, make sure to subscribe, hit the notification bell, listen to us on our podcast on Spotify. Welcome back to another podcast. We have an argument for a little bit about, uh, uh, actually, this is, a, this is the stupidest argument. This is the argument you have with a parent and a kid. This time, the people on the left side of the room are the kids. Uh, don't point guns, airsoft, even nerf to that extent, at a person. Actually, nerf's Dude. different. Dude. Don't point airsoft Dude. guns at people uh, and then claim <laughs> people who complain Dude. about that are pussies. Dude, you sound like a fucking Karen. Holy shit. Don't this this sounds like a teacher's right. note to like every kid. No, like Kai would flinch if I pulled like a like the rubber band gun. He'd be like, "Oh my god, <laughs> stop it, stop right now! Wait, <laughs> it's loaded." Like you guys are fucking okay. Pussies. Well, I have a real Holy reason shit. to why I would want to shoot you, Burke. Uh, and this what? comes out of uh, my questioning of Chris this morning. Mm-hmm. I, and I guessed. I guessed. You okay. guessed. Oh, so you don't know? I don't know, but that was my best guess. Do you make? Do you like to make eggs in the morning? Yes. How many how many eggs do you typically make? Uh, four. Four. Yeah. Okay, over the couple days, right? What no, happens yeah, when I you usually, crack an egg? Uh, I usually leave them in there. What the fuck, dude? What? Okay. That is disgusting. <laughs> okay, I got it right. I open up the egg carton, <laughs> and we have sixteen eggs in a carton. Eight of the eggs are uh, two, two piece crack I think shells. I, think that's just, I understand how it could be gross. What? Because they need to be cold. I have. They need to be cold. No, I just think it's the habit I have. I just like I keep them in there. You know? I keep it in there too until I whisk it, and then I take all the shells out, and yeah. throw it out. But there usually, are, I'm I'm very good at cleaning up everything I no, have. No, you're not, because this is after the back of multiple events where. The amount of random shit left like on the kitchen counter. Like, go, like what? Everybody just leaves okay. The, uh, on the every time counter. pizza is made, uh, all the carton and the boxes are left out. <laughs> that, uh, that is a Spencer move. Spencer's a big fan. So of that it one. is, but it's also it's also Burke. And then uh, whenever someone makes like the pizza rolls or like all that stuff on the, the tin on the tin. Tin never gets cleaned up. Kyle's also a culprit of that. <laughs> yeah, you, um, okay, you, also, you, also, you also have to realize, though, <laughs> most of the time I'm cooking for myself and I also make food for you. But you have that argument all the time, but it doesn't and fucking matter. No one really eats it. And so it's just there. People, and it's you, just, you ate it last time I made Yaki Soba. You, Spencer, Luke, nope. Nathan, and. I, yes, well, I personally I didn't. did not have any Yaki Soba. Okay, uh, well, I'm there was just a lot left. <laughs> this is the size of the fucking point. Okay, Keep this going. This is another argument. Uh, just never also, part of that is walking away after using the ring light, and I only. Maybe three times the ring light's actually been turned off after it's being used, um, mm. so it just generally fits the mm. uh, criteria. Mm. Of I'm trying to get that like not uh, extra like project. lighting on your skin to like help you help you out, you know. Thank you, but yeah. no- normally it's pointed towards a wall, so it doesn't really help out too much. No, it's pointing like t- out towards the door usually. Really? So like, like collects more okay, okay. rays and stuff, you know. Yeah. All that other yeah. shit. Well, you know, yeah. um, I like think the, the photo shell is by yeah. far the most disgusting thing in the world. I mean, it's not even that bad. Half the carton is empty shells left over multiple days. That is bad. That's really bad. bad. There's eggs in there. It's just the shells now. (laughs) Like, what? Because there's still yolk in there that gets gross and sticky. And then besides, someone else is going to have to clean it up. True. I understand. Was that normal? (laughs) I mean, it was normal for me growing up. I mean. I feel the only time I've ever seen that happen would be like if it's like the last four eggs and you yeah. put the last four eggs True. in. I don't know. I, throw it was, that was just entire, like normal for me. I would always just throw like away the entire put it in, click it in. Maybe it's just my family. My family's just not clean. <laughs> <laughs> Which is fine. Based on your room as a kid, I'm going to have to go out and say the cleaning practices were not exactly taught. <laughs> I don't know. This kid had like two-year-old taquitos underneath his bed. And they, they were, were still good. <laughs> oh, that's fucking disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, dude, your bed was literally like a fucking doomsday prepper surplus. Like, you oh, literally awesome. had hundreds of dollars in fireworks under there. Yeah. Thousands of dollars in money. A lot of broken airsoft guns. Like the broken yeah. airsoft guns, everything. Paintball guns, everything. Clothes. And High School Musical 2. <laughs> high School Musical 2. <laughs> yeah. All right. Uh, big thing that's been happening this week, Netflix's new top show of all time is mm-hmm. supposed to be Squid Game. Mm-hmm. Uh, I watched it at first with Chris. He did mm-hmm. commit a party foul because we had three episodes left, and then Chris and Luke just watched it without me. You got sick the next day, and I just <laughs> wanted to watch it. Yeah. <laughs> just, just a little insult you were, to injury. <laughs> you were literally just dead in your room the entire time. I was like, hey, Kai, you want to go watch Squid Game? The biggest issue with Kai watching shows is that the kid literally goes to sleep at six. six. Okay. Six. Like, nobody is going to... It, it, it just doesn't line up. Can we up. agree on this, Ethan? The worst part of watching any TV that's actually interesting with Kyle is that you're on your phone every five seconds. And you True. know that thing where some people, like, get bothered when someone's on their phone when you're trying to watch a movie, even if it's not bothering you? I'm like that person. It's really weird when someone's not paying attention okay, to Snapchat. Okay, well, every time I go to the fucking movies with you, you go to the bathroom five fucking times, so I don't want to hear it. That's and, true. That's, and, that's and definitely you also, a negative you thing. You also have to just realize the, the way my mind actually works is like I can't 
I can't fucking focus on anything. So like, <laughs> like the I have to like have something else to focus on in order for me to focus on one thing. It was a show the other day. Like I was watching some random ass show with you, Kyle. And I was like, oh, I'm really excited to get into this thing. And then right when we sat down, I remembered, oh, this is why Game of Thrones was hard to watch. Every five seconds, I hear, the, I see the flash come to the face, <laughs> yeah. the Snapchat being sent. It's like how many people are Snapchatting you that quickly? Like I haven't Snapchatted somebody like that since like freshman Kyle, year of high school. Kyle's a devious Snapchat list. It's actually insane, dude. It's <laughs> actually ridiculous. It's like thirty girls. No, fun. it's not that much, dude. It's, like, like, a, it's like a best friends list of people. It's Snapchat. I don't know. That's bullshit. I don't think it's that much bullshit. It's pretty. That's I think pretty it's like active. fifteen. Do you guys say anything or is it just faces? Kind of depends. Depends on who it is. Depends on who's feeling special. <laughs> it's definitely like fifteen. I don't think it's that big. I can't. Do you guys still do that? I mean, I have like, I stopped at like three people. Yeah, you used to have yeah. a ton of streaks yeah. though, right? You used to be. You used to. Now it's just like Ben, yeah. Clara, and like. Well, because I feel like Kyle chat. didn't get Snapchat. When did you get Snapchat? Oh, I oh right. Kyle I, didn't get Snapchat until he was like I saw 19. A, I saw a girlfriend. <laughs> how, how long True. did you have Snapchat, but like you were like low key about having a Snapchat? Never, because I remember Instagram used to be a little yeah. bit more secret about having an Instagram. Oh, because my hiding. fucking mom. Come to find out, I was hiding Instagram and Snapchat from my mom for like seven years. For Holy but it shit. wasn't. It became a point where I wasn't even hiding. I wasn't even hiding it. It was just like I just never like brought it up that I had it. Yeah, she didn't care the entire fucking time. Like we like, I was like, oh whatever. What? <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, well, she did care. She did care at one point, and then I got my phone back after getting it taken away, and then. She just uh, oh. we just never talked about it, so I yeah, didn't know. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah. Squid Game. Squid Game is massive right now. It's going to be the biggest show beating Stranger Things. Oh, it's fucking awesome. It is really good. It's pretty good. Yeah. Mm-hmm. What do you, What do you think about it, Chris? What was your first impression? You're more of a movie guy. Uh, I I liked it a lot. I'm not gonna lie. It was good. It was, uh, but it wasn't like it wasn't anything that, but like nobody else can make. You know, like a people putting people in a room, big pot of money, kill each other. Like it's a it's a good, it's like a Eat. classic plot. But it was good the way it was portrayed. And it was Korean. It was good. I like because I watch anime and stuff. So I like. Well, dude, when we first started watching it, you see it and go, dude, there's subtitles. This is some bullshit, bro. Yeah, okay. I'm like, bro, you yeah, watch anime all yeah. day in I, subtitles. Chris, I Chris I is a dub watcher. I, 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 I'm not a dub watcher for Squid Game. If you watch dub Squid Game, you're a fucking loser. Why, dude? It's like, bro. that's a fucking another argument. Like, I don't fucking speak Korean dude, and I don't want to read fucking so subtitles. So, so like, let me so watch my, in English. So my argument it just for. It sounds so much better. My argument for the subtitles in Korean is that you actually have to pay attention. Exactly. So it's good. Yeah. But like, I can like, I know, but I can like fucking maybe like go take a piss and still hear the fucking words in English. Well, you're like playing video games or something and your other screen has Netflix on it. So you, you, you're trying to understand what's being said. Who? Uh, you. What? Right? You watch Netflix on the other side of the screen? No. no. Oh, you watch just watch it on your yeah. phone or something? Yeah. Then you watch it dubbed? Yeah. Read the crazy. damn thing, bro. No, dude. Why? Because it, it doesn't also sound help, right. It also no, helps with your reading. It's uh, Everything's good. Dude, bro. It's <laughs> like... It's <laughs> like... Low blow. It's true. But it's like, why would I want to watch something that I don't fully understand? Because you read it and then fully understand yeah. it. No, I understand. I can read it. Like, I'm fine with reading it. But, like, why would I want to focus on the bottom of my fucking phone or my screen when I can't even, like when I have to, uh, that's all I have to focus on. It's not it's like there's that. something about watching an authentic Korean movie and it's being delivered well. You just gotta watch it. Yeah. But I you, understand but that, but like I want to watch it in English. Like I feel, I feel. But you guys would really go out and say you guys think Squid Game is really good. I would say it's like I wouldn't say really eight. good. I, I think, think the production really is insane. Really, the production is very okay. Insane. The first episode like got like got me. I feel like this is when I mean, the guys. By the way, if you haven't seen it yet, uh, just watch it because there's gonna be. A ridiculous amount of spoilers. Um, I, I heard you're supposed to do that. You're supposed to let people know. Yeah. Yeah. You're about to ruin it for them. Or we'll get you more hype for it. The first episode is about you, disco- you discover the guy, yeah. the main character. Well, I forgot his name. Um, uh, oh, yeah. Uh, Song Ji Young. Mm-hmm. From Xing Chang Wu. Exactly. It's Song Xing Wu from... <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. Song Xing Wu from Song Xing Shua. I think it's from... Oh, yeah. I, think it's from <laughs> I don't think that's his name. Hefe. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's he's his first name starts with S. I thought it was Jin. Isn't it? Isn't it Seong Jin Ho? Yeah, I thought it was Seong Jin Ho. Seong Jin Hong. Uh, no, and Ho. He's from. I'm terrible. Seong Jin so. Ho of. Of Seong Ding Hong. Yes. Bro, he is so fucking annoying. He literally pisses me off so much. Yeah. How many episodes are you in so far, Kyle? You're the only one that has a seven, shit. seven or eight. Oh, okay, you're deep. Yeah, so wait, what, what pisses you off about him? He's so fucking dumb. He literally is like the most two faced gambling ass bastard in the entire world. He'll like literally like go through, tell someone like, oh, trust me, trust me, help. Like, and yeah. then he just does it for himself. And then it almost, 
it almost ends up biting him in the ass like almost every time. Like every mm-hmm. time something kind of happens to where it's like, dude, I just want like I like him because he's like the main character, yeah. but like he's also I kind of hope he just fucking gets murked. Mm. I feel like 218 was the guy that was like that. Which one was 218? 218 was the guy with the glasses. Yeah, the guy that. Oh, yeah. Wait, yeah. The, no, the doctor? The glasses? Yeah. No, the oh. Korean guy. He's not a doctor. He's the guy that was like that the, the prodigy, yeah. went to the uh, Seoul High School. He does have glasses. The market. Yes, he does. He is the market uh, what? son. The market mom's son. The one that at the very end. Yeah. Yeah. He's, he's glasses? He has glasses. He has glasses. Yeah, the prodigy. Yeah. He's a dickhead too. No, but that guy sucks. That, that guy sucks. Rest because piece, he betrayed uh, the Indian guy. Yeah, that's yeah. Right. Oh, Ollie, dude. All he's dumb. All he's dumb. All he's dumb. All he's dumb. All he's All he's dumb. 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 All he's All he's dumb. 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 he's dumb. All he's dumb. he's he's dumb. he's 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 yeah, but he got the money. All he doesn't know the difference between odd or even. It's like, bro, come on, figure it out. <laughs> yeah. True, he didn't True. know that. There were a ton of things that he didn't know. Is it because he? Yeah, all he got fucking murked. Oh, yeah. and then he and then he the tried slums. to play. He tried to play um, Siong with the umbrella game because he knew. He oh knew yeah, that, that was what the game was going to be, True. and like. I don't know. He's annoying. Like he, he took the fucking triangle. You can literally break the triangle then, off like, without even licking let it. Let the yeah. girl bleed out. Like, why do you have to go be a dickhead and just go kill her? Oh, and like, go let her bleed I mean, out. I mean, that's why I feel like he killed himself. He just he knew that he just deserved to die. He, oh, like, he there's knew a, there's a solid spoiler. Oh, for him. <laughs> <laughs> I I don't, I don't oh yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, I feel yeah. like he like felt that he needed to kill himself because he like yeah. fucked up everything. Yeah. yeah, and that allowed the last guy uh, Song Hee Jae Long to actually survive and yeah. keep on going. Mm-hmm. Uh, but I was pissed that my favorite character was the old man and he was the bad guy. Yeah, he put it all together. So That's fuck. nuts. Oh, really? Uh, that yeah. was kind of Oh, shit. I, 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 fuck it, dude. He, we're I mean, going to talk gonna, about this I'm episode. I'm going to watch it anyway. Like, That's fucked. I think I, I think I read that in a TikTok comment. I just spoiled <laughs> the whole show. <laughs> Wait. Oh, so in the beginning was... Like, Wait, so you want to talk about it? I, don't, I mean, I'm going to watch the show anyway. Yeah, the old man was number one, right? Zero, yeah. zero, one. Yeah. Uh, but a huge other theory about it is that when you watch the red light, green light game, like, you know how he's all happy moving around and, yeah, like, yeah. freezing? Mm-hmm. He knows how the song goes, right? Mm-hmm. So he has his confidence because he put the game together. Yeah. But then you notice, like, when the machine zooms in on him and, like, scans him, everyone has this, like, green glow around him except yeah. him. He's mm-hmm. the only one that doesn't have the green glow. Yeah. People are saying that tells the machine, do not shoot this guy. Yeah, I watched that back to, like... I saw that theory and I watched it back and it was like actually true. And like people around him, it's not just him. It's like the people in his vicinity. Yeah, don't get shot. Don't so get shot either. Yeah, so, so if you stay around him, you would have been safe. So he's safe. automatically like safe. And then that's why, you know, like the, um, what was the fucking, oh, fuck. The tug of war? No, the, you know the marbles game? You know how he was sitting by himself for a little bit? And then Shing, what's his fucking, the main guy, yeah. came up and saved him? They were going to... Uh, because no one wanted to be with him because he was like an old man. So that's why that one girl was safe. Fuck, I don't forget their names. Yeah, the, you know the girl about? that was oh, yeah. shit and had sex in the bathroom. That's yeah. what she was. That was, I was like, why didn't she because die? Because no, the partner. game, that he knew that no one was going to pick him, but the main character actually like picked him. So And there was one person left, and they thought it was going to be the old man as but, well. Wait, she didn't get raped? Wait, wait, wait. You thought that... Okay, so when they all had to go in groups of two, and she was yeah. the only one left... No, no, they have to go in group team, teams of four. Uh, wait, no, it's four good. teams. No, pairs. Pairs. pairs yeah. And she was left. Mm-hmm. The girl that was hooking up with the thug yeah. with the face tattoo, mm-hmm. she was left. And you thought she got taken away to get raped? Well, because when they were in the doctor's place, they were talking about what they would do with the female, like the dead females that would come through. Yeah. And they would all take turns. All the, yeah, all the whatever I I don't yeah. know the name. The triangle guys. Yeah, no, no. The 20 yeah. Twenty eight and twenty nine. Yeah, yeah, like the circle guys. They would all take turns having sex with the dead bodies. Down yeah, but she, but she was just left out, so she got to like skip no, the game. Yeah, exactly. no, I was, was just saying because out. because they, they like took her away. I I, I was just assuming because they yeah. took like four of them took her away and like she was like right. screaming and shit. I don't know. Originally, they thought like old man was gonna be left out, but then the girl got left out, so that. So that's another example oh, of why the okay. old man like played the game like how like made the game how he did. Oh, okay. So I'm yeah. So I'm kind of curious to see how that unfolds now. But so like you know like the opening scene was the was the old man like one of like the kids featured in that was he like the kid that won it? Oh, oh. And that, no, I think that was um that that was the main character. So in the first scene when it's black and white and they're showing them playing all the squid game like on that field oh, of yeah. school, I think that was Song who uh, and it was both of them. 
The old man and him? No, no, no it no, was the kid. No, the two gl- eighteen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's the two people at the very end. The prodigy kid, uh, <laughs> the guy with glasses, and then as yeah, well as yeah. Song Ji. Those are the only two that knew. Like, oh, they didn't have. Oh, God, their fucking names are so hard to say. And yeah. then yeah. comes to find out the whole time when you move all the beds, all the games are around the room. Yeah. Did you see that? Yeah. Like, in, oh yeah, yeah, in, yeah. Once they take the beds away, the walls actually have all the games written on them. That's a little too big of a giveaway, yeah, right? True, true. Right? How dumb. That would suck. They literally that show tug of war over like a dropping. Yeah. Thought, yeah. Like, what the fuck is that? Yeah. I thought they moved all the beds at one point. I'm surprised they didn't see that. What? Do you I know they did yeah. move the yeah. beds. Because they moved yeah. every single bed at one point when they set up, like, when they were like worried about like the second true. fight night. True, true. Yeah. It, the first fight night was I, bullshit. I will give it to him. It is a, it is a very, uh, you can talk about the show very easily. Um, mm-hmm. Like, you know, like, it's always fun to, because, like, I don't know, when me and my friends, like, we watch Breaking Bad, like, that one summer. I don't know if, yeah, uh, yeah. Like, yeah. we, like, watch. It was, like, 2017. It's fun right? to, like, come back and, like, hang out and, like, talk about, like, what happened in Breaking Bad or, like, Game of Thrones. Like, you talk mm-hmm. about crazy shit that happens. It definitely mm-hmm. has that aspect. It does. It does. Season two is going to be huge. And then you know how, you know how they got chosen? Yeah, I have this too. Yeah. So, uh, so supposedly in the Squid Game, the mask guards pick the red card. Many of the theories about Squid Game uh, stem from just how people find themselves involved in the shadowy underground contest. One compelling theory is that during the uh, during is that do, uh, doing the rounds is linked to the card game Dakaji. Song Ji Hoon is asked to play at the train station episode one. Viewers remember that Song Ji Hoon would win ten thousand one. It sounds like a lot, but it's about six dollars and twenty cents. Yeah, it was a hundred thousand. It was a hundred thousand one. Oh right, I don't know why this it was, was this. Yeah, it was a hundred thousand. So it's about sixty bucks. Yeah. Then every 60, time he man. Oh. No, that'd be. Wait, oh yeah, that's mm. still not that much. Wow. It isn't because uh, I thought it was gonna be like I don't know like five hundred bucks. Yeah, right? exactly. You're getting your ass slapped. Uh, he managed every time yeah. he. Every time he manages to flip his opponent's card, he gets that money. If his opponent manages to flip Song Ji Hong's card, Song Ji Hong gets a slap in the face. The businessman asks Song Ji Hong to choose between red or blue cards to play, and Song uh, chooses blue. When he arrives at the contest later in the game as a contestant, he's wearing blue boiler suit. No, but yeah, exactly. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Some have uh, theorized that those properties... Are you just reading off the fucking paper? Yeah, I am. Fuck it. Some have uh, proposed that people who choose the red card instead become the mass guards. The red-coated uh, supervisors oversee the competition and help eliminate contestants. Oh. So more people choose the... Bl- okay, I see what's happening. Yeah, mm. but you don't know that if it's going to be that one, right? No. But also, like, you choose the red card and then you get the opportunity to just go, like, just kill people? Like, I don't know. Like, that's way harder than, like, playing the game, you know? Having to murder people. But they had an, nah, oppor- they had an opportunity not. to fucking leave the game, but they- and then they came back. Even the guards, though, you think? I mean, probably. I mean, right? yeah, like, what else have they been doing, uh, right? I mean, you guys remember that they had their own cells. Like, when the cop goes undercover True. into the place... Yeah. It's like yeah. they lock them up like they're actually in prison. Mm-hmm. That was an interesting part too. I don't. I don't think that they. I don't think they did that correctly. There was some shit that happened there that was wrong. What do you mean? Well, like what went wrong? With the cop, like with everything with the cop, like there's just no way in hell that like that. You get away with that. I mean, they know literally everything about everyone that's there. Like literally every no, single but they part. They have tags on their back of their helmets. So like, I'm just saying, yeah. like, there's no. He fucked up true. so many. Times. And he just somehow has cell service and a fucking underground. Like you know what I mean? Like he did. He had to leave the island. Remember to get the cell service. Oh, did he? Oh, he ran up the mountain. Yeah. Oh, was he? he was just taking, yeah, I, I, he was I just haven't gotten there yet. Okay. Um, I don't know. I mean, I there was just some stuff that just seemed like unbelievable about how. Yeah. But that main. What's that? What's the main girl? Sixty seven's name. Um, you want to look up the cast real quick, Lou? Oh, her name's like. Wait, are you talking about like, like in the ho, show? Ho 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 ye. Oh, was it right? Yeah. I feel like it would have been, been nice if they added like three more episodes in the beginning to give them character development, like. Outside it would have gotten old though. It would have right? gotten so slow. You because, gotta get to the good part. Because the shows that's are. Why the first, that's why I like the first episode because the, the red light it went straight to the red light and green light. And if they just gave got the guy murdered. Was that in oh. the first episode, yeah. Say, yeah. say, Bjork. So Not I was like, though, oh, because if what, they what, gave the guy with the tattoo his own origin story, that would shit would have been entertaining. The fucking gang fight. You saw shit. it a little bit over the yeah, over the show. Shit, that was lit, and I wanted more of that. True. Say, be wait, what's her? How do you say it? Say Bjork. Say Bjork. Yeah. Bjork. Bjork. Say Bjork. Ba- say Bjork. Dude, she grew fucking <laughs> 10 million fucking Instagram followers. I know. In like I a know. week. I know. Bro, Here. it's fucking insane. I literally followed her at like a million. Yeah. And now she's like We have million. to get into that, but real quick, I want to finish this up real quick. What did you think about that theory? Like the theory of, re- of the red card versus the green card? Oh, no. I think it's 100% true. Like, you think, I think it's... Yeah. Dude, it I makes total sense. Like no one really would catch up on that unless you watch it again. Yeah, but dude, if you're choosing the... But then, if you get chosen to play the game, but you're instead of playing games, you're just supposed to kill people if they get games wrong. Yeah. That you're. 
I mean, also the theory could be a lot. Of, the other theory was that they're past winners. That's why they're so old. Some of the characters are old and young when both of them took off their masks. Oh, you know right, right, right. So they could be past winners. But because the head guy, like the mask man in the gold mask, is the brother of the cop, mm-hmm. you're saying that he's that because he won the competition before. Yeah, maybe. Oh, okay. that no, guy's not the actual brother of the cop. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You haven't, you're gonna get there. Real that's that, crazy. That was weird. That was more of like, dude. That's. Hopefully they explained it more, but it seemed like more of a throw, like a throw. Wait, like oh, wait, really? that's my, that's his brother. wait, like the like main really? masked guy. Yeah, is the brother of the cop. Is the brother of the cop. So yeah. he's the but, brother. And, of but the cop is a hundred percent alive after that. Shooting in the shoulder? Well, I don't get. Is yeah, he he, I, he gotta be fine. They didn't show him dead, right? No, he shot him in the shoulder and fell off. He's gonna come back. Yeah, he's you guys high. are spoiling so much for Kyle. <laughs> I mean, the thing is, like, yeah, I mean, I, I've, I've already, I've already seen a lot of shit. On, I've already seen a lot of shit on TikTok. I just don't, I don't get how you go. He's looking for his brother, and his brother has the most rinky-dink room, like ever. And he finds his card, and that's how he finds where his brother is. But, like, if your brother has that weird room, but he's the headmaster of the games. Right. It's just weird. That is weird. Like, why wouldn't he be living in a, you know, you're probably making a lot of money doing that. I don't get it. Yeah, that, that part is weird. Well, no, because he doesn't, he didn't pay rent because he was never there. Oh, so he's gone the entire time. Yeah. Right? That's what the lady said. Well, she's a week, he, she said that he's a week late okay. on rent. Yeah. So he was living there before. And then, yeah. and then how's it all, why so how's, mean? how's the entire thing funded? Is it from the VIPs? Yeah, I think so. They have to, like, buy it. Can we talk about how shit their English was? <laughs> yeah, the English was so writing bad. for those VIPs. Like when the guy takes away the the, uh, the boy and goes, oh, he's going to have his own little fun. Yeah. And he yeah. goes, I'm picking, what number did you pick? 69. <laughs> yeah. He goes, dude. what about now? That was well, like 96. Of, yeah. Honestly, or it's when, pretty spot on. <laughs> spot on American acting. Or when the, uh, the, one, the one girl, like the one that was hooking up with the thug pulls the cigarettes out of her vagina. Oh yeah, that was just graphic. I was like, yeah, you know what? Didn't really need to see that. It yeah. was just like a, she was annoying. I hated that. She was fucking, bad shit, crazy. I fucking hated her. Yeah, she, she was, was nuts. Like, she was just hopping around group to group, hoping to fucking make it. Yeah. That was cool. What she did at the end though, when she like jumped off with him. I was like, that's pretty cool. Dong Kyung. Yeah, because like that's gonna be that guy's gonna be a pain in the ass if he lives any longer. Oh, did anybody else want the two girls uh, to fucking make out when they? When, oh, when during they were the playing marble the marble game, game. <laughs> like I was watching it like last night, it was like three in the morning, and she like pushed her up against the wall, and I'm like, I gonna fucking make out? I was I was gonna be so fucking stoked yeah, about it. No, dude, I was like literally like, bro, fucking make out. That'd be so sick. I, yeah, I thought both super hot. Yeah, they're both pretty attractive. The 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 main the main character girl's definitely definitely sexy. Yeah, but really? no, you think oh, she's yeah. you, you really like song? Wait, what's her name again, Lou? Save 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 Bjork. You want to go to her Instagram because she's the one that grew 10 million followers. She's also she was fu- at 400k before the game started. You know, she's I know. Before she's the show. fucking ridiculous. And uh, when I fucking started watching the show, I followed her at a million. And she's at 10.1 now. She's at 10. In like a week. It's I found it. two. She was at 10.1 this and morning. And I want to say I put you guys on this show before okay, the okay, show. Did, 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 did I not? Did, you did. did I not? Yeah, but it was the number one show already. No doubt. It was the number one show already. Oh, do you hear Lou? But like, it was the number one show already. Yeah, that's what Lou just said. That's, that's no, it was I, not. I saw it everywhere on Netflix. Bert, Bert, you gotta admit, you can't say you found the show when Netflix is saying number one show. Watch now. It's like everyone. Found yeah, it. I didn't. Mr. Say Netflix that. told us it did. It didn't say that. It's I also see, it said it said top ten it, and it was at number one. That was maybe <laughs> at, maybe two days after I told you. Have you guys watched? Squid okay, fine. Okay, fine. You put but like on. a lot of people binge watch Netflix. I'm getting a lot. Also, it's pretty cool. She's five ten, which is fucking sick. Wow. She's also twenty seven. That's and her favorite, cool. her favorite Disney princess is Ariel. Hot. Hot. She likes it you wet. Lou, scroll down for I've me. I've never <laughs> seen any like love towards... Uh, I don't even know if I should say it. Say it. I don't know, I've just never seen... Uh, towards I, Korean women? No, no, I've never seen Kyle and, and, and Burke simp over the oh, Asian girl before. I think they're going to start watching... Uh, what do you mean? My first girlfriend was Asian. <laughs> oh, dude, oh, that kind doesn't of, count. Kind of. Like, kind of. Come on. Okay. Chris, she was. Chris, are we dude. thinking that they're gonna start getting into like uh, the Korean Blackpink and all these uh, K-pop girl I mean, groups? Yeah, possibly not. I'm just saying this is my first time ever seeing them simp over. Okay, not. I'm, I'm gonna go out and say not exactly my type, but she is very attractive. And is it because of Netflix? Style? As I'm telling you, every new girl on a Netflix. No, no, no. They just happen to find the hottest girls <laughs> yeah. that they're on. like. The- Madeline Klein is literally a top one percent hottest girl ever. She's really? okay. Really? Oh she, my god. She looks like so many other girls. Yeah, bro. it's just like mm-hmm. you can't see that. Okay, click on one of their pictures. I didn't think looks... she was that amazing. I thought the other one was more I thought interesting. She had better yeah, really? like, I wasn't, yeah. like, Dude, the she's from time... Dude, she's from the north. She's from North Korea. <laughs> like, north, north Korea. They don't actually mean North Korea, do they? Yeah, she's from North Korea. Her parents Vogue. are still there. She was in Vogue? Dude, she's like, like the top Korean model. 
Yeah, I mean, she's what? like the best. Good. Oh, really? Apparently. Well, Luke, how often well, do you jerk off to her? Well, the other girl. Wait, scroll down, scroll down, scroll down. She just grew. Uh, wait, she no. just grew. No. She just no, go grew. To the bed. I know, 100,000. She was at go to the one. bed. She was at go to the bed. No, no middle photo at the top, Luke. Oh. Middle photo at the top. Look how many followers this girl has. Uh, go to her, who she tagged. Oh, yeah, the girl that she tagged in this picture. It's a, Dude, it's in the oh. bottom left corner. Yeah. Um, Look at this shit. Just, just drops a 52 million bomb on us. Jesus. She has oh. 52 million followers on Instagram this picture. Dude, Kavi's going to pass you. <laughs> Kavi's going to pass. That's nuts. Bro. Well, they do it different over there in Korea. They do. It's it all about like the cute too. and like style. Yeah, it's like their feet is just like meant to look good. No, yeah, the Asian fashion influence is crazy. How do you have 52 well, million so, followers? So I might. So I went to school in Eastern Washington, and the it, it, you, I would describe it as like a, a it's lot like a, of Koreans. It's no, no, not. <laughs> but the Koreans there, like there was a guy that drove a gold wrapped Supreme like Mercedes. Somebody has a McLaren over there, and mm-hmm. like the thing, like they'll go back, like they went back to Korea for COVID, and the whips were just there. Yeah, same thing at my school. In they Atlanta. just like they left just leave the whips them. there. They don't care. It's ridiculous. They have so much money. No, and like everybody, to the like what? I'd be wearing like a hoodie and fucking jeans to class and shit. Like hoodie, like classic P and W. I don't mm-hmm. know. And then these kids are like all just drip the fuck out, yeah. like Balenciaga, fucking Versace, like literally everything. The ones at my school would have Chinese cigarettes that they would sell to the kids because they're so much better quality. I guess that's what I've heard. And what? they would just like have Chinese cigarettes and just be dripped out driving Teslas. You notice that everyone on the show smokes too, which is crazy. Yeah. 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 Okay, do you want to go to another one of her pictures? How does she grow that much? Like her social yeah. blade's like over a million a day. Well, she that photo has like eight million likes. No, so. no, that that one on the bed has like seventy five thousand comments. It's crazy. Right. She getting all this hype and she dead season one. It's crazy. Yeah, oh, she is true. dead. Yeah. Isn't that crazy? She died and then they give she's this famous Look at that. from one season. The Netflix comment on that has fifty nine thousand likes. What a suck Holy out. shit, dude! That's crazy. I mean, yeah. They, like how you gonna die right? season? So what, what do you think is gonna happen in season two? Uh, there's a theory about that if you want to hear about it. Yeah, I'd love to, Kai. Hopefully they put that girl's body away. Oh, so that they don't fuck her. That that'd be fucking disgusting. Yeah. Oh dude. yeah. And what were they talking about? If, uh, if the if the, go- if the guards started fucking her dead body, that would not be ideal. So 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 <laughs> no, was, they burned her right away. Okay. As a, a show of respect. Okay. Was that shit? Um, Remember that? Was like the organ selling? Oh yeah. Was the organ selling? Was that? Uh, Ended when when they were found out. Well, yeah, yeah, that, that was happening under the table. Yeah, but that never like got brought back up. No, because they could have made that a really big part of the show too. Like if they had like a whole like organ crime ring it that was that, like that, that was like that was what was like funding the jackpot. Yeah. But did you guys also notice when they talked about like the person that had like a zombie like zombie insides? Zombie insides. I feel like I've yeah, been. Way, I, I, feel yeah. like, I feel like I paid way more attention in no, the, I, I, in the I, I surgeries know, part. I mean, I mean, they were talking about like uh, this one guy's like, like insides were all fucked up. Yeah, yeah. And uh, I I was trying to figure out what it meant. I didn't know. I think he just had like cancer. Or yeah, something. like terminally ill. I don't. Yeah. I but I thought it was really interesting. Like they cut him open and they said like it was fucking gnarly. Yeah, all this shit's fucked up. Yeah. Huh. The show uh, was really grotesque. It was a very grotesque show. Mm-hmm. In the final episode, Shang uh, Jion had has dyed his hair red, winning the game and collecting the prize money. While this could have been a cinem- uh, cinematic decision to show uh, the once affordable and happy-go-lucky character is now a changed man, having seen so many people, including his friends, die, others believe that this is a piece of foreshadowing. Song Ji Han has chosen red and will return as a masked guard for season two um, to take the games down from the inside. It's a bit of a stretch, but we do end the series with Song Ji Han uh, determined to track down wh- uh, whoever is still allowing the games to continue. So maybe th- these suggestion theories have something going on. What do you think about that? I, that's a, that's a good theory. I mean, Honest. Red hair shows. I guess he knew he knew he was gonna go back, but he didn't know like what he was gonna do when he goes back. So that's like a guard. Yeah. Real quick, just go see your daughter real quick and then come back. (laughs) Yeah, seriously. (laughs) Seriously. Why everything gotta be so fucking sudden? Seriously. I think that he's gonna. I think that he's gonna put himself into a hard place again. Yeah. Yeah. That guy has a serious, serious gambling issue. Mm -hmm. Well, yeah, he hasn't spent any of the money though. Yeah, he didn't spend. He was. He was. Oh yeah. He when he won it, when he won it, he, he was like traumatized and didn't spend it for like a whole year. His mom died. That's oh, really? the whole reason why he joined. And he stayed homeless for a year. Oh, good to know. Like, yeah. That sucks, bro. Like the only reason why you joined, you finally get the money and you come back, she's just dead. I mean, I don't know. He was kind of a deadbeat kid. Yeah. He was. He'd fucking like, steal all her shit. Yeah. yeah. Uh, another theory is that uh, Song Ji's, that Ul Il Nam 
That's the old guy. Is it actually uh, Song Ji Han's father, the main character's father? Yeah. Right? Uh, Song Ji Han has an instant rapport and bond with the elderly man. Oh, because yeah, they, were, they were talking about how, remember when they were playing the Marvel game and they were talking about how his son's birthday was whatever day and apparently there's something that said, because when they typed in the fucking pin number for his uh, the bank, bank card? Yeah. It, it was the same. Uh, no, it was the same number as his jersey. No. Yeah, it was zero Chris, five. you got to talk to the mic. It was zero, it was zero four six. It was zero four five seven. No, it was my birth. It was my. It was like it was oh six oh eight or something like that. No, bro, I'm telling Dude, you. Dude, I swear to God, in, the pin number he typed in was Look his at jersey. It. Kai's it's reading the theories right now. He uh, he knows it. No, the pin ther- the pin number was his, his number. jersey, right? Yeah, his yeah, jersey it was number. his number. It was like zero four five six. six, and that's that was two days off of uh, the old man's supposedly son's birthday. I mean, yeah, probably yeah five, okay. I That's mean, interesting. I don't see But it, it was here. two days off of it? Yeah, but the like, old man's fucking delusional and fucking old. So he real, probably forgot. No. Like he did about everything. He definitely won the but game, when, so they just gave the pin as his number. Dude, he had dementia. Oh, he, oh, oh, he has actually, dementia. Actually, you could be right. Because the when they were walking through the town, yeah. he's like, this is just like my old town. And then he's like, I grew up on a street just yeah. like this. Yeah, but he, because uh, they did the game together, they built it after like where he grew up. Yeah. True, but the but well, the kid but said the same. Dude. But the main character also said that it was just like history. Yeah, but not the oh, same house though. Yeah, okay. Like, he would remember that that big ass house. True, but also the the old man didn't wasn't for sure if it was his house. Yeah. Okay, because uh, he has dementia, no, and that's no, why he doesn't Kyle, know. Missed, like, he exactly. doesn't. At he the doesn't. End, in, the, in his hospital bed, you'll see. But he was saying like that part was true. He doesn't oh. have dementia. That was all cap. Yeah. No, it fucking wasn't. He had dementia. He said it in the beginning of the. He said no, the he has a tumor. The tumor yeah, and he real. had dementia. He can't I don't think he was going crazy, dementia, though. Burke. He can't control Bro. the game with dementia. All right, uh, uh, then another scene uh, sees the pair discuss the similarities betw- uh, between the set design of one of the games in their neighborhoods growing up. <coughs> uh, and then uh, the show's twist, twist, which reveals Ulni Ilnam was a game VIP who helped create the challenges, has led many to claim that the whole tournament was devised by Ulni Nam to find his lost son, especially when he gives Sol, Sol Jihan his jacket to protect him in the game and adds it was fun to play with him. All the tournament um, all was a ruse for a father and son to have the childhood fun they could never have. Oh, so the entire idea is that the father and son get to play games together yeah, like they never did as a, as kid, like when he was a kid, mm-hmm. and that's why he built the game. And then and he wins so that his son has money now. I get yeah, but this so is weird. So out of place. Like these theories are biting. One, if you have that much money, you'd send your kids child support at the beginning of the movie. <laughs> Two, they didn't even set up the, the him missing the father at all. It was just mother, mother and son fun. It's, they didn't mention the father one bit. And then three is just like, why would keeps you, wait you questioning? The last? Huh? It keeps you questioning. True. I know, but it makes like, you want to watch. Uh, there are also th- series, uh, theories about past winners being um, workers too, but uh, the, the the show is in- insane. Like season two is gonna be nuts, but there's like so much hype. Like it's a question of can it live up to like, you know, being as good as the first season. And all the big people who grew like eight million followers are dead. They're dead. So so what do they do now? Like just start modeling again? Yeah, probably. Or be. I think it's gonna be like more Korean yeah, films are gonna be big. Yeah. yeah. Right. Well, I mean, dude, uh, if I'm an actor right now and I get hired for a Netflix spot, like you take that instantly. It, the amount of people that are just getting blown up and getting their careers fully started off Netflix, it's insane. Yeah. Because like, I don't know, all those Stranger Things kids, all the Outer Banks kids, all the fucking too hot ti- to all handle. Tiger King, Too Hot to Handle, mm. literally everything. It gets fucking blown up. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Like yeah. they got like they got fucking Jake uh, Gl- Gildenhall. How do you? Jake Gyllenhaal. Yeah. Gyllenhaal. yeah, they have him on a mo- He's the lead role in the movie coming up. He's like a fucking 9 on 1 dispatcher. Mm-hmm. Like, crazy. Yeah, and they also keep you like a part of the family. So, like, you, whenever there's other movies that come out, you'll have the role. Yeah. So, like, yeah. It's yeah. the first on the list. Yeah, it's nuts. It's I weird mean, how the main guy doesn't have an Instagram, though. None of them have Instagrams except for no. her. It's so weird. Maybe, I think that's why she grew so no, much. No, 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 no. All the, uh, those two, the two guys, the, the main character and the, other fuck this the nerd guy they don't have Instagrams but all the other girls the girl the crazy chick does the, the oh I want to see the crazy chick's Instagram Lou the guy with the snake neck does all he has one oh really I want to yeah. check them both dude, out those guys, dude, those guys those guys are like six four yeah they're gonna fucking tall yeah they're huge because <laughs> the girls five the girls five ten really yeah That's tall as fuck okay which one is Donkey Hawk what's the what's that guy's name the guy with the tattoo yeah the tattoo guy that guy was interesting. 
Oh, I think that's him on the very left. Yeah. Dyke Soul? Yeah, that's him. Is that him? Dyke Soul. Yeah, whatever Dyke Soul. Yeah, right there with the glasses. He doesn't look like him, though. Jang. That is him. Oh, oh yeah, that's so totally him. Wait, really? You want to look up his Instagram, Lou? I'm so curious what he posts. <laughs> Right. He's got 821k. Oh, bro, he, I'm pissed about him. I'm like, this is <laughs> oh wait, look at the first picture. It's a picture of him and Ollie. Yeah. <laughs> oh wait, Ollie. Let me see. Ollie. Instagram. Instagram. Wait, wait. Look through his Instagram first for a second, or put it on another tab. I just want to see Ollie. I just want to tell me Damn. Okay. Okay. No, he's definitely been other film, dude. I think I've got the seen Indian his face influence. so many times. Yeah, 1.6 mil. By the way, great Damn. shit, bro. Yeah, if he Korean is in your first language. Great shit. Great shit. True, 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 true. What's up, bro? You gotta, you, you gotta go to school, bro. <laughs> you gotta go to school. In the <laughs> show, is <laughs> learn odd and even. Dude, that shit was so Does funny. He have all his Dude, he was. No, he, he doesn't. Have, you should have seen the look on his face when he found out he didn't know odd and even. He's and just fucking tricked him. Mm-hmm. And he he still fucking beat him in the game. Yeah, but then he just got fucking bean boozled. <laughs> That's nuts. All right, you want to go back to Dark Chalk? I want to see this guy. Literally being boozled. <laughs> Literally straight being boozled. <laughs> Opens the pouch and sees pebbles. <laughs> Literally got being boozled, bro. Imagine there was beans. <laughs> yeah. Maybe real like being boozled. Uh. <laughs> Dude, that guy's a suck. Bro, but they were playing the Marble Hall game. Yeah. yeah. And he's like, <laughs> <laughs> just two scumbags. I like I like this though because this reminds me of old Instagram, right? It's not just brand deals; it's actual lifestyle shit. You right? Know? Like where like and he has a lot of following. Where it's like nowadays, all I see is like no, he didn't have a large following. He now he has a large following. Yeah, I was saying he has a large following, and he's still like he's still doing like regular shit. Because like, whereas, like, the like, brand deals are probably coming in right now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's gonna start doing bang next week, bro. Yeah. But you see what I'm saying, though? Like, yeah. how <laughs> actors in other places can imagine he's a, a normal fucking dude. Yeah, exactly. He probably doesn't yeah. need to do brand deals. Should we it? just get one of these guys on the podcast, bro? Dude, if, if, if you're a guy like on a fucking I mean, popping all... web, web series on it, on like in, in America on Instagram, you'd go all out on your Instagram page. That's what I mean. It's crazy. Yeah, compared to like somebody that's actually doing like who, who does that? What's an example of that? Like anybody with above like 100k would like they'd spruce up their Instagram 10 times more than he has. Probably. Mm. Kai thought the brother was from Shang-Chi. Uh, Shang-Chi. I know I <laughs> fucked up. I fucked up. It's not. We both looked at each other like, is this an all Korean movie besides the one? Guy? Yeah. Yeah, he's Chinese, so I fucked that up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I remember you said that. You're like, dude, this guy from Squid Game is a part of it. And I was like. No. <laughs> oh yeah, I'm the dumb one. Fuck. Yeah. <laughs> Fucked up. Oh, he's born 1979. Uh, the, you know what? Uh, I looked at when I was using hashtags for my reels. I was posting the guy that plays the guy on the subway doesn't have an Instagram, but he has like fan pages that have like yeah. half a million. Yeah, they have mills on. It's nuts. Are you talking about? Are you talking about like the first businessman? Yeah, like go over to the right a little bit. His name's Song Koo, I think. You oh, yeah, he's in the middle. Gong Koo? Gong? No, it's Gong, Gong Yu. I'm way off. Yeah. Is this a cop? Yeah, he's yeah. a cop. He's like the biggest model supposedly in Korea. That's or not one the, of that's them. not the cop. That's the guy. No, that that's the, the, that's, the that's the guy that plays the game. That's what Subway, I mean. Sorry. Subway. That's that's what I meant to say. This guy. Gone oh, you. Yeah. He's huge. Where's his IG? They do be having straight they, they clean have one, ass though. faces though. Like their face is just oh. clean. It's a fan page. Look at that fan page and it has half a million. This account's a fan page. Jesus. Like, how are your face that clean? I know. He's they, a pretty good looking guy. They have these crazy, like, rituals where their faces are, like, not, have no pimples or whatever. It's like, hasn't even exposed to air yet. <laughs> well, it's not, like like a big, it's not like a big thing in Korea. Like, your grandparents, like, will give you money for, like, to, plastic, for, surgery, plastic surgery and shit. Yeah, like, there's a lot of Koreans who, like, when they move to America, they go back to Korea to see their grandparents at 16. And for, like, a birthday gift, they give them a nose job. And the kids are, like, offended, but the grandparents are like, no, you need to work on your nose. Your nose is they're fucked like up. Of like arranged marriages no, arranged marriages don't happen. So but they, they care about their and looks? none of them have facial they, hair either. They just want them to be beautiful, and if they're not beautiful, there's something wrong with the people. Like it's it's, it's super. A, have you seen a like a Korean person with a beard, like a yeah. whole ass beard? Really? Oh yeah. I feel like no one in like the show has a full a ass beard. Duck Dynasty beard. I think it's less common, but yeah, for sure. Can you look up Koreans with beards? Oh, it's it's definitely a thing. Yeah, it's yeah, like it's old men with beards. That's a huge thing. Oh, true, true. Right? Old, old men, <laughs> <with> <laughs> like a young look up <laughs> old Korean women with massive bushes <laughs> on their face. No, no, I'm saying like young, younger Koreans with beards. 
Like a 20 year old Korean with a fucking beard. Like me. Wow. Uh, that's uh, a little weird. That's very. Wow. Okay, some people it works on. Like, that looks normal. I mean, yeah, I thought like the normal guy that goes to work, the average guy <laughs> has, like, a fucking beard. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah, that guy's part American, though. Uh, <laughs> uh, has to be. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That guy yeah. definitely doesn't. Right, so that's normal. You actually that's, have to be a mustache of, model to have like a mustache. I feel like that. That's see that. Yeah. See that. Like see that's what I envision. Yeah. 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 The little chin strapper. A little chin strap. And then the dragon tattoo on the neck. <laughs> 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 bro, no, that was like a snake, bro. That shit was that. That was such a bad tattoo for that guy. <sighs> yeah. I do want to just switch topics. Yeah, let's switch topics. We, like we gave her way too fucking long. Yeah, that was. <laughs> it was actually good. Uh, what else is happening this week? <laughs> I, I wanted to go to Rick and Morty. I didn't, I didn't get to go to Rick and Morty. What do you mean, Rick and Morty? Soldier Boy concert. Oh, you know what I'm well, well, Ethan it's and I. Big Draco. Like yeah. I never got to see Big Draco before. I'm mad pissed. We were, we were. Ethan and I were at a taco place like three days before the Rick and Morty concert, and this yellow Lamborghini pulls up, and like Soldier Boy jumps out just at like this like random strip mall taco place, and I'm like. What in the soldier boy? Yeah. But like he was like filming a video and shit. But we were gonna we we wanted to go up to him and ask him like, yo, dude, can we perform Rick and Morty to you? Uh, for no, like yeah. TikTok, for Jesus for, Christ, yeah, dude. performing Rick and Morty to Soldier Boy until he performs Rick and Morty. Bro, <laughs> I feel like he would have said yes. He probably would have. I just didn't really want to. I I, yeah, I didn't want. Why is he? I, I didn't want to get DJ Academics no, by was, Soldier. No, he, fucking, he performed Rick and Morty at that club that night, and everyone was going. He played, performed two songs: Rick and Morty and uh, Crank That. Crank That, Soldier Boy. Bro, no and other. That's it. God. No other cartoon gets respect like Rick and Morty. Yeah, I feel like besides anime, when it comes to like. No rap. anime doesn't get any respect. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> really? You really? It you doesn't put your left nut on that. Don't do. Don't talk about anime like that. Oh, Chris. you're right, dude. I'm sorry. No, I'm just saying. I love you, we can don't. check the, the earnings of anime. If don't you do that. If you, shit, want, if you if you want to talk about it, Kai, I, I don't like. Why don't you watch anime, Kai? Like, I never asked you that. Because I grew up watching real anime, like you know, and I just don't. Uh, you know, he's, I can watch. He's other whitewashed. Shit. What's a, what's a real <laughs> what's a real anime? What's a real anime in fake anime? Like anime that's meant for Japanese people on Japanese televisions, and they or don't make it with storylines that. Like, I don't know. They don't translate it. They don't put it international. And, like, all my toys were those characters. All the things I played with. And then I moved over, and now I just watch The Office or watch... You saw, you like, you saw like, the American anime, like, Pokemon and shit. Oh, that's why, the real ones, yeah. This is why Kai wanted to have sex with Doctor Who in, like, seventh grade. <laughs> yeah. Would you have fucked him if, if, Doctor, if Doctor Who DM'd you in seventh grade on Instagram and said, hey, you want to fuck? Okay, dude. You don't even know. He fucking reincarnates as a new person every time he dies. So, which Doctor Who would I like to fuck? <laughs> That's the better question, and the answer is, <laughs> yeah. You definitely um, want to fuck them. Yeah, man. But it, yeah, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed that episode. No, what did you guys do this week, though? Weekend? Yeah, I was sick. Uh, weekend. I was sick. Oh yeah, it was a fuck. I started party on a Monday. That was fucked. Yeah. So what weekend? You? It's like, hey, you guys, party on the weekday. Bad. Yeah, it's literally Friday. It's the weekend now. Yeah. It's Friday then. I'm gonna Friday. stay in this weekend. Uh, peace out, everybody. <laughs> peace. <laughs>